So I feel like SummerSlam exists because of uh, of that, of uh, being able to to revolutionize and evolve young people and equipping them with the 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 tools to advance the kingdom in a huge way and impa and in an impactful way. The next question is. Why did I find it necessary to re reestablish uh, SummerSlam in 2010? Well, there is a lack of of uh, positive and edifying um, influences on our youth out there, um, especially in the realm of cyberspace and social media. And I feel like this time around, reestablishing SummerSlam, we will we would we will approach our our ministry in that area of you know of of e outreach and and evangelizing um so i'm really excited about that um how has summerslam changed my life well personally um summerslam has planted so many seeds in me to be this man of god you know, and um, so um, it has changed my life tremendously. Um, I mean, without without the influences of SummerSlam, I probably wouldn't be, you know, as 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 rooted I as I am now in God. So it really helped me out. Okay. Uh, What's the next question? Where do I see SummerSlam in the next five years? Well, I think potentially SummerSlam could really be on the on the on the page, on the front page. You know what I'm saying? Um, it's really up to the leaders at this point. Um, um, it's it's really up to the leaders at this point. That's all. I, that's all I really am going to say. Um, once the leaders come together and unite. And sh and share the same vision and passion, then SummerSlam would would be somewhere huge. You know, I would I would even dare to say, like a mega fest in the next five years, 2015. I can or 16. I can see SummerSlam like, you know, in a, at a venue where it's packed out in thousands. Okay, um, but you know, it, it's up to the leaders. Okay. Uh, when, when I think of SummerSlam, what's the first thing that comes to mind? First thing that comes to mind is 2003, jamming when he wreck shot and he shut he shut it down. I mean, we should have just shut down SummerSlam right there, and we should have just went into worship. <laughs> I mean, because you know it, it, we had never seen anything like it. Never seen anything like. It. Uh, the, of the likes of him, and um, that's what I want to see SummerSlam, you know, in the future, uh, really paving the way and setting trends um, for the world to see, um, so we can reach those people, those young people that are that are unsaved and that are lost. So, yeah, that's the first thing that I think of. There's a lot of things that come to mind though. You know, I, I remember when Tony A came. I remember, you know, SummerSlam when it first started in Midland, and well, and it was always part of a Juneteenth because that's when the masses are out, the world is out, the black, you know, the, the black people um, celebrating Juneteenth. Um, but SummerSlam has evolved a lot now, so um, we'll see. Um, so yeah, I'm excited. So SummerSlam, let's go.